lookbook but there's some actual pieces that i like themselves that i want to just highlight for the most part but the lookbook you know as per usual is good right everyone's a big fan of the lookbook let's get that up on screen here for you guys to see so i can comment along do, 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 do. there we go yep so um again um great lookbook as per usual um i think this features sage is it sage elsa whatever his name is sage something yeah um so first look here we've got a leather blazer is it a leather blazer with some track pants and a shirt on the inside looks pretty cool um, nice necklace i'm not really a fan of the jacket there the hoodie's nice the formula one hoodie looks really cool the trench looks good again with a d-ring fastening on it this suit looks good i like the pivot they're doing i, I wonder because remember when they first launched um when they started doing the first couple of suits i think they the first couple of suits might have been with com or no no it was adam kimmel right um legendary new york designer who's now kind of like out of fashion and i think he's retired i'm not sure what he's doing but I wonder if Adam Kimmel, if Adam Kimmel got um, absorbed into Supreme and he's now advising them on how they do their suiting. Because it looks very Adam Kimmel-ish, the suits. Maybe not as baggy looking as some of the Adam Kimmel suits, but maybe that might be because of the aesthetic has changed and shapes in general since he started doing his stuff. But um, I wonder if, if so. But this suit looks really cool. Um, I'd hope some kids will purchase those because I think, you know, by and large, Supreme are doing a good job of kind of, you know, aging their customers um, or, you know, um and, and you not know, giving their customers a wardrobe that they can wear that's age appropriate and um these suits for kids that are like you know maybe gone off wearing box logo hoodies might be a good way to kind of transition out of wearing kind of you know quintessential streetwear items but i like the suit i think it looks really cool um little styling detail with the button looks good as well i'm not really a fan of the raider stuff um i had a couple of things back in the day remember when everyone was wearing like you know american sports team attire back in the day like baseball jackets and jersey tops and stuff i had a few things but nowadays not so much i have a couple of hockey tops but that's about it which i hardly really wear i only really wear in the summer but I'm not really a fan of wearing a all of a print raiders thing but you know i guess if you're that way inclined it probably might fit you um i love this leather this leather um this leather jacket um with the supreme kind of italians what what do you call it script handwritten on the back it looks really cool i think my favorite color so far of that this jacket is a sort of burnt brown um colorway that looks really cool it reminds me again of another supreme jacket i had before that i sold like an idiot these teal pants as well i'm not mad at um yeah big fan of that um the cardigan is a fucking win easy for me that entire looks a fucking win is a kid's got a fucking cigarette in his hand doesn't he these kids are cigarettes man He's what he's like. He, this kid's like seventeen and he looks thirty-five, isn't it? Right? Like he's aged like a motherfucker, man. Like cigarettes and booze will probably do that to you, I guess, isn't it? But hey ho, um, he's got great hair though. That's a good thing. He's got good, good head, good set of hair on him. Um, but yeah, the cardigan looks really nice. It's like a cardigan with block colors, looks like for the most part, and black ribbing. And is that a t-shirt? Yeah, leopard print t-shirt on the inside. Yeah, I'm a big fan of that. Not not mad at it. Um, denim jacket with the sort of fastens on the front and supreme will love it not a fan of but i like the patched up pants um this is my favorite jacket too man it looks fucking insane and it's probably something you're gonna see all the asap boys wearing they love wearing fucking stuff with skulls and pretending they're dark and shit but i like it anyway in general i like this look it's got a big uh, flaming skull on the front white jacket with chains all over it and the matching trousers big fan of that um don't really like this look with the embossed uh supreme bomber they're making a lot of these again aren't they so i think uh, the level production has kind of stepped up a bit they're, they're making a lot of their own sort of like bombery uh down filled jackets nowadays um so probably not you know at where they would have probably lent towards um using north face more they're now doing a lot more inline stuff in terms of you know uh fluffy bombery jackets that you can wear for spring you know kind of roll up and put in your bag or put on top when you're feeling a little bit cold um again nice plaid gore-tex top oh it's gore-tex as well that's awesome i like that not mad at that at all not a fan of that red jacket denim jackets of course always do really well for supreme not really fan of the back I'm not sure who the artist was again i like this jumper with the premium on the side the pants look really nice as well with the roses i love this it's um it's cut like a denim like their standard um denim jackets they have a well a couple of those but i'm not sure if it's pile or if it's faux fur or if it's crushed velvet but it looks fucking awesome burnt orange i'm assuming this is going to be one of the more popular pieces coming out um the next couple of in the, in the next couple of weeks or the next few weeks for the spring collection something that's quite versatile you can use in most outfits I'm, I'm sure it's crushed velvet right it must be crushed velvet um again a big fan of that um this sort of like what would you call that i like this jacket plaid jacket right um with zips on the chest 
and two front pockets there these white pants look really nice too i'm not sure if they're combats or anything but they look cool uh this pink jacket looks amazing i think comes in another colorway that i'm a fan of too looks fucking incredible in range of like 90s era um north face or Berghaus jackets um there's a shirt also with the drill that he's got he's wearing a pants the pants with the white pants with the drill on it drill illustration there's a shirt for it as well that looks fucking cool um the playboy bunny stuff i'm I've never really been a big fan of uh, again the map thing i think written by guns looks really fucking cool i like that uh raiders vest not a big fan of the, the jacket I, I like this is from an artist with the reaper logo right with the reaper painting i forgot the name of the artist i looked it up earlier but they look really cool um yeah again great collection as per usual from supreme let's get one more here what's this one um playboy bunny shirt not really a fan of there that kind of jamaican is that, is that Jamaica colorways? I think it's, I don't know. Um, the Orange Bomber, of course, always does well for the Supreme. That's like a staple piece. They always bring in a couple of seasons out. Um, nice short sleeve button up shirt here. This jacket looks really cool. Reminds of something Noah did, isn't it? Um, this jacket here, sort of like a sail colorway with two big front pockets. Um, I like again this kind of like piled fleece jumper. Looks amazing. Looks something you pick up in a charity shop with Supreme written on it. I like that. It looks really cool. A nice jacket again again so big big fan of all of it um i'm gonna go back to this pile jacket right here it is right oh it's a fuzzy pile i knew it yeah fuzzy pile trucker jacket looks fucking awesome love that um a couple of pieces here i'm a fan of like this leather varsity jacket is one of my favorites as well um in the collection and i can't wait to see more of it um but yeah I'll, I'll i'll show most of the other favorite pieces later on i need to collate and make a little sheet of it some i've got some pieces that i have my eye on that i want to purchase very very soon but i'm assuming yeah that's going to come out what next couple of weeks i'm assuming right is that the next couple of weeks what, what day does it say here um for the new supreme stuff biddy bing bada boom bada bing oh this oh it's, did it come out yesterday no what's the day today 22nd our uh, oh yeah it did yeah it came out yesterday so yesterday in london online um on monday cool that's all that's all well usually it's on a friday isn't it but it's all okay the following week. okay no worries so um for those of you that are listening now you've probably already got your piece your early pieces already right i'm assuming you early fucking wankers